guys, Dandelion Song here. This storm was pretty amazing, and I think that some people really did say to the mountain, move, because look at the way that this article is written. First of all, I couldn't find any updates on the CNN site right here. It just has it just this paragraph with the was, and then nothing else is different. But here it says that nobody died and very little damage. Look at this. Uh, no reports of deaths or injuries, a remarkable stroke of luck, considering that Patricia packed winds up to 200, 200 miles per hour when it struck. Uh, that, there's kind of mixed reports on that. And then they say it just immediately fizzled right after it struck. Uh, let's see. It says that Puerto Vallarta, home to 200,000 people, that was a little bit of ways away, was largely unscathed. It says that this storm is now dissipated. Um, that such a huge monster storm could inflict so little harm seems wondrous. Patricia formed suddenly and quickly strengthened into a hurricane. Uh, within 30 hours, it had zoomed to a record-beating Category 5 storm catching many off guard. By Friday, it was the most powerful hurricane on record with a central pressure of 88 millibars, according to the Hurricane Center. Patricia's power was still out, uh, wh wh while still out to sea was comparable to that of Typhoon Haiyan, which left more than 7,000 dead. Experts praised Mexico's, or uh, hurricane experts praised Mexico's expertise at storm preparations and credited good fortune. I'm wondering if I'm reading that right, because hurricane experts, oh, oh, they credited good fortune. Okay, so they're saying, so hurricane experts are saying that this was due to good fortune. <laughs> Maybe some people said that the mountain move. I know there are a lot of strong-hearted people in Mexico, and uh, people all over the world were saying to this mountain move, they're saying to this storm, be calm, because people knew that this storm was not right. Let's see. Uh, so I think we did this together. And they're not going to really cover this. I don't know. They might. They, I don't watch television, so I don't know whether they really cover this. But they, the media and the powers that be, they don't want you to know that you have the power to say to the mountain move. They don't want you to know that. When you love, when you, when you say to something from love, if you say to the storm calm, if you say something with authority and love, you're very powerful. This giant, the, the giant, most giant storm ever fizzled and nobody was injured or missing. I'm, I'm really amazed. Let's see. Uh, the most affected part of the coast did not have a large shallow area conducive for piling up a huge storm surge. Okay, so I guess it was deep there. The storm was also moving fast enough at landfall, 200 miles or 20 miles per hour, that its heavy rains did not stay in place long enough to generate flooding. Mexico's transport secretary put it another way, nature was good to us. Mother nature. Interesting. All right. You guys be safe out there. Remember that you have the kingdom of God within. You have the ability to say to the mountain move. And you can say to the mountain move to protect your brothers and sisters here and anywhere else. I'm so glad to see this today. All right. Love you guys. Talk to you soon.